Hey everybody, welcome back for episode number three. Shadow Run returns. It was just released today. Uh, when we left off, I had just made friends with this guy, Jake Armitage, and uh, we're gonna go take care of some gangers for him and hopefully locate his stash. Oh, look at that ambient life form. Crows. What is this? Looking for a date? Trolls are my favorite. Nobody says that. That's gross. What are you, an orc? Get out of here. <laughs> oh no. That doesn't even look northwestern. I don't know. That's weird. I thought there was a thing over here. There it is. I want to investigate the trash pile. What is this? What have I found? Hidden in the garbage strewn alley is a high tech safe with a mag card reader on the front. Open the safe with Jake's mag card. With a smooth hiss, the safe opens to reveal a collection of gear that is perfect match for your skills. <laughs> well, what are the coincidences? Enemy turn! Oh no! Hand over the loot, brozos! Wait, I mean bozos? Oh yeah, you're not gonna like this. Oh, I don't have anything. I'm going to uh, club this guy. Oh man, just pathetic. And Jake's got a gun, huh? Allow me to take some cover and then uh, take myself an aim shot. Crit 16, crit 14. We better get rid of this baseball bat before he gets too close. Ow! Come on! Ah, God! Why is this happening to me? So, if I, like, come around over here, do I get, like, a flanking bonus? Somehow I doubt it. At least I actually did some damage. Oh, wait, should I be putting on gear right now? Probably. Oh, come on! Misclick. Oh, it cost me a smack in the face. Dang it. Here, I'll take this kill. Bam! Finally, I kill somebody. Now, do I have to worry about hitting my guy, or what? Apparently not. So, welcome to the Barrens. Guess I'll need to find you a new spot to hide my gear. Good, dead drops are so hard to keep. Oh, wait. Good, dead drops are so hard to keep. Some dreck in every city these days. Uh, so I shouldn't invest in real estate. He chuckles. Well, at least they were too dumb to break my mag locks deal with that. That was it? Oh no, that's our next one. Now that we've gotten some gear, let's go deal with those Halloweeners. Don't mind if I do. Alright, so let us learn about gear. Spin karma? I have two karma. Weak. Is this gear? Aha. Weapons? Outfits? How do you see what you have? And how do I use that? Confusion! Because this is why you do, uh. Think. What? He's got all these spells. How do I use this stuff? Inventory is not a thing. Uh, uh, I don't know how to put on gear. I'm so lost. 
Okay, we're back here. We can spend karma on the character sheet. Here's the inventory. I have a trauma kit. Confetti grenade? What? Oh. Not confetti grenade. <laughs> Weirdo. Should I just assume that we don't actually have any gear? Yeah. Alright. Let's just move on. I thought he was going to give me like you know, actual gear, like armor and stuff. Apparently not. The man before you appears well-mannered, but nervous. Excuse me, sir. I don't know you, but you look like you can handle yourself in a fight, and we need some help. I only fight when I've been paid to. Calm down. How can I help? What's your problem? Some thugs are shaking down the market we've set up here. Hmm. It's been getting worse lately. I don't think we can afford to pay them anymore, but no one will stand up to them. And Lone Star isn't about to get involved. Where's this market of yours at? How many of them are there, and how much are you paying? If it's on my way, maybe I can help. Where's this market of yours? It's just down the street, sir. Please, our livelihoods depend on this market. Great. Side quest. Just down this street? Sarah with an H! Her clothes may be dirty, but this woman is far from downtrodden. Hey, not that it's my business, but I wouldn't go that way. Nice to meet you too. Frag off! Uh, what's going on? Just some Halloweeners stirring up some trouble again. She points to the south. They rode in this morning on those fancy bikes, set up camp in the old street market. They've been marching up and down the streets all day, shaking down anyone who wanders past. Typical. Well, odds are those are the guys we're after. Anything else I should know about these gangers? Hmm, well, their leader's a big old troll named John Paul. Real piece of work. Even for a wiener. They call Halloweeners wieners. That's funny. Yep, that's him. Jake checks his pistol. Sounds like a friendly bunch. Are you going to be safe out here? She laughs. You think I'm dumb enough to get caught out in the open by one of those assholes? Nah. I know these streets like the back of my hand. Worry about your own skin. Thanks for the heads up. Null sweet. What does that mean? No. Oh, null sweat. Wow. Wow. Way, way to get that reading done. Commerce is like a weed. What? Taking root in the cracks and crevices of the world wherever it can. A small street market has flourished here amidst the crumbling buildings of the Redmond Barons. Okay. And then? Look, Bank, just pay up. We barely have anything left. Not my problem. Pay up by morning or else. Ooh. Oh, that's Jake. I'm like, why is this guy on top of the building? Can I get on top of the building? Head thug. The thug attempts to use his bulk and hideous breath to intimidate the shopkeeper. The old man is holding firm, but you can see the thug's patience fading fast, and he looks like he's about to start breaking things. Eh? Who the hell are you? Uh, etiquette? Mm, yikes. Strength four. Hey, punk, I've got a better idea. Hand over today's take, and I'll let you leave alive. All right. Hey, now. Let's not get all nuclear here. Chummer. He calls me a chummer. I'm sure we can work something out. He slowly reaches into his pocket and holds out a bundle of Nguyen, his hand visibly trending, trembling. Look, I need your scratch. Give it to the woman. It seems like this would just be causing more problems. Because <laughs> he's going to, like, take it out on her. Oh, now all of a sudden she has money to pay. He looks at the woman, then back at you, tossing the new unit on the ground, and he sheepishly turns to leave the scene. Can I still kill him? Aww. Oh. Darn it. Hmm. 
Apparently I did the objective for the bullied uh, shopkeepers. Well, damn, I wish there were more people like you around here. I've never seen anyone stand up to those thugs without getting beaten bloody. Nobody gets in my way. Just trying to help out. Why am I so nice? A freaking troll. Nobody likes me. So why do I like them? That's what I say. Watch out for those gangers. I don't see any gangers. Don't go to the market. I already did go to the market. Vlad. As you approach, the man sizes you up. Why does everybody size me up? I'm a freaking troll! You can see the age-old fight-or-flight equation <laughs> running behind his drug-clouded eyes. Beneath the track marks on his arms, you spot a set of tattoos that indicate he is, or at least once was, a shaman. Uh, what's your story? Nothing, no story. Nothing, just leave, leave me alone. I don't see anything, I swear. I had enough of this. Calm down. No. What didn't you see? <laughs> Nothing. I didn't see anything. I I just I just need my fix. But I can't get it because of big pumpkin heads. Yeah. The pumpkin heads down the street. They kill everyone who looks at them funny. Man, I am having a hard time reading. Calm down. Uh what you no, no. I've had enough of this. What? Okay. Oh, 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 okay. The broken man backs away, hiding his head in his hands. Great. Get out of here. God, I hate that I can't just kill somebody for no reason. He's a drugger. Who cares? Look at me, I'm adding ER to the end of every word just to make it sound more cyberpunky. Oh, what do we have here? Don't hurt me. I'm not going to hurt you, but I know I'm a troll and... Oh, too close. Halloween Century. Hey, asswipe, take another step forward, and we're going to plant you right there. This is Halloweener property now. Great. This is one of the two that got away. If I hadn't missed my shot, this idiot would have been given up and moved on by now. These idiots would have given up and moved on by now. Wait a minute. You're rolling with Jake. Bad idea, chummer. The Halloweeners are collecting that bounty and killing you and killing you well that'll be a nice bonus uh yeah about that can I like do I have more abilities with my fists no not so much what about this the adept's hands become lethal weapons for four rounds sounds good to me does he have to actually have to cast it, or...? I'm so confused. What's happening? What's this? Inventory. Alright. Well, seeing as how I have lethal weapons in my hands... That's it? Come on, man. Spells do you have? Aim. It's already over there, isn't it? Heal wound. Flamethrower. What's the difference between aimed and aimed shot? Whatever. These guys aren't that hard to hit. Stud B file. No, no, no. There you go. Ah. Bullets do so much more damage than my freaking ba baseball bat. Go figure, right? If we ever fought skeletons, I'd have you beat, though. Oh! What's that like? Uh oh. Oh, is that a shotgun? You might want to move. Just saying. Can I make it all the way to this mage? 
enough AP. Not enough AP. Alright, well, you're on your own, sir. I'm gonna run up here, hunker down. You should probably either try to kill this guy in one turn, which is not gonna happen. Oops. Or look for some cover. Oh, I should have flamethrowered him. Uh oh. Ow! That's the one. Come on. How's a mage get out of that? Should I position myself better? That seems crazy. Let's try it. 12 damage, and you didn't catch on fire! Whatever. Well, you're dead now. 8 damage! Okay, what's the deal with my to hit here? There we go. Oh, come on. I really got to be more careful. Uh, uh, uh. It doesn't look like very much cover, but whatever. I am going to end you, little man. I'm tired of you. Why do I only do seven damage? Whatever. Another... I don't get the kill. Oh god. You're dead. Oh. It's, it's the head guy. Critical for 20 damage. Awesome. Uh, what we got here? Yeah, let's just do the damage. Can I just hit one and not have to worry about that anymore? Whoa, uncle, uncle, really? That quickly? I was just playing with you. I'll call off the rest of the Halloweeners, Jake. Call it even, yeah? What do you think, Jake? Dirtbags like you don't deserve second chances, or don't need second chances. Then lower your weapon and walk away. Now, what do you think, Jake? He smirks. Hey, I'm already at shoot on sight status with these guys. Killing John Paul means one less wiener to shoot in the back when I'm buying smokes. Hell, they'll be doing the same to you as soon as there's a profit in it. You're right, let's finish him. I want him to tell his friends what happened. Um... Uh, 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 it's such a hard choice. Let him live. Uh, nah, no sense to deal with him later. Oh, Drek. Oh, Drek indeed. He's only down to half life. He's fine. Can I just hit one or Yes. Karma gained. Visit the murder site. Well, I suppose Are there like bodies to loot or anything or wounded three, wounded four. What does that mean? There are definitely no bodies to loot. Well, all right. That was super exciting. How come we're not using any of this stuff? Is it murder site? I suppose. Uh, 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 uh. When we... <laughs> oh, wait. What does the four mean?
Huh, I don't know. Anyway, uh, I suppose with that, we will uh, go ahead and end this episode. And we'll pick up for episode number four. We'll go visit the murder site and all that stuff. So thanks for watching.